So basically, my story is so today I went out to um, I went out out to the the you know I, I live out right outside the city I live in, and I went I went to go to a bar. Well, we went to me and my mom went out to go to eat, and. When I was going out, going out to eat, my mom wanted to go to a bar because she just wanted to be social. She just wanted to go. I was like, okay, I don't really care. Go to a bar with your mom. You know, it's cool. So I went to a bar with my mom. You know, I'm 21. I really don't drink, though. I'm not a big drinker. Um, and so I went to go. Oh, my God. It's so fucking annoying. Um, I went to go drink. Well, she went to go get a drink. She just got some wine. She didn't get some, nothing too, like, out of the place or anything. Oh, what do I want to get rid of for this shit? These are all good. My God. And, um, give me one second. <laughs> Fuck it. It's not even worth it. Let's throw it out. But, um, I went out, I went out to, um, we went out to get a drink and then I went to the bar. We, you know, we went to the bar and at the bar we met all these rowdy ass young rich people. Like, people who are doctors and, like, doctors and... People who sell wholesale houses and a whole bunch of other shit like that. So I went to go sit at the bar. We talked to them for a while. They're crazy ass dudes. The dudes that were with the, their girlfriends were crazy. So the two dudes left the um the bar, and my mom had to go to the bathroom. So um <sighs> these girls are probably like five years older than me, so they probably like got out of college for a while. Um. I feel another, uh, um, and I'll twist them in there. And I went to college, I mean, I, you know, I'm a college student, but they're like, they're kind of out of college for a few years. And as soon as their boyfriends left, they both started hitting on me, like hardcore hitting on me. They're like, it was an Asian girl, a cute Asian girl and a really not look cute looking, um, black, uh, white girl. And... And what happened is, <laughs> well, <laughs> they were asking, she, the first question I was asked, because her boyfriend wasn't acting right, was, <laughs> was, was I fuckable? <clears throat> no joke, no lie. I was asked that straight up. <laughs> and, <laughs> and she asked me if I was fuckable. And the other Asian girl, she was saying sorry for her friend, but her face was red too. And they were drinking a lot. I don't drink, but I could tell that they were drinking a lot. And the stuff they were drinking was no joke. And I felt bad because their boyfriends were kind. They were rich people, but they were kind of assholes. But they were they were they were assholes to the girls, not to other people. And I kind of felt bad for them. And I don't know how I feel, but because I don't I don't date other people's girls. <laughs> I'm, I'm just gonna stop for a second so I can tell the story. And it was a very awkward situation because they were still hitting on me when my mom came back from the bathroom. Cause they were like, they're, I'm, um, and so I don't know. It was a really weird situation. Cause both those girls like me, they were older than me. I always attract older women. Like this is a, is a personal thing. I attract older women. As long as they're older than me, I normally attract them. And they said, I look pretty. I always thought I looked good, but I don't think I ever looked that good. But apparently I look that good to older women. And I always get hit on. I get hit on by every yoga coach I ever go to. And, and that's, it's a very weird story. I just It's a weird story. I'm probably going to tell again in probably more better detail out of this little segment video or whatever I have right going on. But, uh, yeah, and that, that was the most awkward story, you know, <laughs> I had today. Oh, God, my life.